And this man right here is one of the stars of that show. He's toured all around the entire world, jumping on trampolines. This is Mr. James Johnson. If you enjoyed that, just remember this is still on that time, it just gets crazier from here. So hopping up on the trampoline next, he is currently tying his shoe all by himself. And he is our resident wild man. He does the skis, the snowboards, the wall, he does it all. And you guys, I can't tell you how much fun it was to watch. This is Tanner Mickelson. Olympics. You'll be able to see it in Tokyo next summer. And just like in traditional gymnastics, athletes are judged on their height, difficulty, style, staying on the trampoline. And they're judged from 1 to 10. And so James is going to offer to you, for your entertainment, the first routine, which is the easier of the two. I'm not saying it's easy, but they're just trying to show off control and height. And afterwards, you guys can give him a score and judge him. It is okay. James is used to it because Tanner and I judge him constantly. Oh, uh, let me get going to open up. Yeah, doesn't he make that look good? What score do you want to give him on that one? Let's see where those fingers. A 10, a 7, a 3. Oh, we must have some Russian judges here, apparently. But anyway, just, just to make things interesting later in the show, let's give James a 9.9, .9, just so Tanner has to jump way harder later on in the show to beat that. Good idea, I think. So, uh, moving along, I hope you guys are wondering how we ended up here jumping on trampolines for our living. Um, Believe it or not, we actually didn't use to jump on these. We would just sell these over in Eastern Europe. But it didn't go so well because the checks kept bouncing. Oh, oh. yeah, the dad jokes, they're going to keep coming. We're not done yet. But the next moment or so of our show slows down just a little bit. But even though this is one of the slower things that we do, it's one of the more technical moments. Because each of us grew up playing traditional sports like baseball and soccer. And we had a lot of fun like that. But then we just, and chess, chess master right here, he does it all. But we had a lot of fun and then we discovered trampoline and for us, we enjoyed that more. So we thought, what if we try to jump and flip and play catch at the same time? That would be a good idea. And to guarantee that you guys have a good experience, we want you to enjoy every minute of the show. If we catch it, we would love some cheers. But if we miss, I think you know the appropriate behavior for that. Which is almost more fun, right? Yeah. Do you want to practice that part? <laughs> Get ready for it? All right, so boo. boo. On the count of three. All right, Tanner's going to lead this. One, two, three. Boo. Which leads me to the next part. Do you guys know what it's called when an athlete misses a catch in a game? Uh, incomplete pass, that's one thing. A fumble, that's another. But here, flipping out, it's called unemployed. So, <laughs> catch the ball, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, so James wants to throw it now. No, 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 you got it. You were up there. So, if he catches, you know what to do. If he misses, well, let's not find out. Who's going to catch them all? James is crazy good at this. There's one. Two, yeah. Yeah, he did. He twisted around and caught the ball. It was great. 
You're going to try it off your feet? All right, well, I've got to tell you, Tanner's been working really hard on this. An incredibly talented athlete. He is the only person I'm aware of in the entire world that does this stunt. He's going to backflip, full turn, and catch the ball.